Cymatics is the study of visible sound and vibration. Let's say you play a sine wave through a speaker attached to a dish of water. Depending on what frequency you play, a pattern will be made in the dish of water. Now, the effects on water are interesting on their own, but by mixing some of that water with about twice as much cornstarch, we get what's called a non-Newtonian fluid, a substance that flows like a liquid, but under stress stiffens into sort of a solid. And this makes for some rather interesting results under strong vibration. Watch what happens as I turn up the amp using a 60 hertz wave. Higher frequencies work as well, but seem to require a bit more amplification. All that from cornstarch, water, and a little sound. Ooh, it's better than sea monkeys. You don't have to feed it. See what happens if you leave it on overnight. <clears throat> Wake up in the morning and there'll be a six foot cymatic creatures walking about. Yeah. Probably not, but could happen. And if you're interested in making your own pet cymatic blob, here's what I used. One subwoofer speaker with the center removed and a plastic dish hot glued to the rim. To generate my frequency signals, I used a program called Perfect Tone on my Mac. I then ran my laptop's output into an old guitar amp. I then connected the guitar amp's outputs to my modded subwoofer. The cornstarch solution was about two to three parts cornstarch to one part water. You might have to experiment a little bit to get the mix just right. You'll know you've got it when it moves like a liquid but stiffens when you try to stir it. <laughs> 